I'm Seth Weldon with Seed Studio. You might know about the microbit. It became pretty well known when every year seven student in Britain received one. Since then, it's become pretty big with education all around the world. Here at Seed Studio, we're proud to announce our Grove Inventor Kit for microbit. Why don't we take a look at what's inside? In the box, you will find the user manual and project guide, a light sensor, a speaker, a red LED, a rotary angle sensor, ultrasonic ranger, four digit display, gesture sensor, and of course, the microbit grove shield, a one meter LED strip, this is also waterproof, a micro USB cable, which is used to program and power, and also 10 alligator clips. The lesson book contains a total of 12 lessons and challenges. We're going to go over two of these, sunshine and gesture recognition. So the first thing we're going to do is plug it together. As you can see in this diagram, this shows that connects into P0 or P14. So we'll take our Grove cable and we'll plug it into P0, P14. There we go. Plug it into the light sensor goes in. Now, this light sensor will be able to spit out a value when you have it low and high. And this will reflect onto these LEDs. When it has low light sensitivity, it'll be zero. And when it's high, all the LEDs will be lit up. So first, we're going to grab a forever loop. Located in basic, drag that on out. Next, we're going to go ahead and grab the LED bar graph under LED, there it is, under LED, plot bar graph. So we're going to want to grab underneath advanced pins and we will want to do analog read because we're going to be reading in the value from our analog sensor, the light sensor. Drag that out, attach it up top. And you'll notice it's already P0, which is perfect, because um, that's the pin it's currently attached to. And then we'll want to change this value to 255, which is the max value. Next, we'll want to actually grab a little pause so that we don't read too quickly. That's located in basic, as you can see. And we'll change that to 10 milliseconds. Awesome. We're actually done with the code, so we can save it and download it. There it goes. Now I can go ahead and upload this to my board and we can see how it works. So now that the code's uploaded, we're gonna go ahead and plug it in and see what it looks like. Yours should already be up and running. There we go. As you can see, they're all lit. That's because it's at full brightness currently. As I cover it, it goes down. You can see this dynamically change as I give it more shadow and it gets darker. It changes the level of the data it gives is a lower value as it gets darker. And that is the end of the sunshine tutorial. We'll move over to the gesture tutorial next. This uses our gesture sensor. It can tell if we're moving right, left, counterclockwise, closer or further away. Take the cable, plug it right in. This is um, I squared C, or I2C as some call it. We're going to plug it in to the I squared C slot. Oh, oh, there we go. Now we're good for the code. For this code, we want to go to Grove, grab the on gesture function, go to basic, grab, there it is, show string. We want to show right. On gesture right, we want to display right. There we go. And then I'll duplicate this. On left, show left. Duplicate this. Um, delete this part. Basic, go to more, show arrow. When we come towards it, or forward, we want to show north, which will be an up arrow. Duplicate. When we go away, backwards, we want to show south. All right, now we can save this and upload it to the board. Let's see how it does. 
I already have this one plugged in. Uh, this is a little bit harder to show, but let's give it a shot here. Get into position. So you can see as I come in closer, up arrow, down arrow when I go away. Works pretty well, works quickly. Left and right, there's left. Show right. There we go. So this has been successful as well. This is pretty cool. Um, you can tell what directions people pass by the sensor or if they're coming closer, further, or even if they turn clockwise or counterclockwise. And that is the Grove Inventor Kit for Microbit. We hope you enjoy it. Thanks.